Namaskar and welcome back to my story time. You know, we're on our last episode of our Ramayan series. <gasps> yes! We are coming to an end of our series and we're about to find out what happens in the battle. In our previous episode, Lakshmanji had gotten injured and Hanuman had carried a mountain and flown to Lanka to provide the Sanjeevani booty that the doctor had recommended. And now Lakshman was feeling better. We generally feel better after having medicines, right? So now Lakshmanji entered the battle again and he fought with Indrajit, where Indrajit tried to use all his magical weapons, but nothing worked on Lakshman. And then Lakshman used his magical weapon and defeated Indrajit. Indrajit, who's son of Ravan, was now defeated. How do you think Ravan felt? Was he sad? Ravan was angry. And now all the more reason he wanted to fight Sri Ram. So you notice a pattern with Ra Ravan? How he doesn't have remorse or sadness. He just keeps getting angrier and angrier and angrier. Not a good quality, right? Now, Ravan was preparing for his final battle with Sri Ram and Sri Ram knew this was going to be a very tough one to win, but he needed to because he had to defeat Ravan, get Sita Ma back, and also save the people of Lanka from this bad king. So he prayed to Sun God. Now why Sun God? Sun God gives so much energy to everybody in this world, right? We need sunlight, plants need sunlight to grow. Because of sunlight, we have rain, which makes plants grow, and then we get the food. So, Sri Ramji prayed for extra strength and all the powers that he could get from Sun God and then he entered the battlefield and he fought with all his weapons and then Ravan was fighting with his weapons nothing seemed to defeat Ravan but then Sri Ram remembered something that Vibhishan had said Vibhishan was Ravan's little brother and he had said you need to aim for the belly button. That's where you need to hit him. And Sri Ram thought of God, he prayed hard, and then he used something called Brahmastra, which was the ultimate weapon. He prayed on that weapon, aimed for it, and what do you think? Ravan was defeated. Everyone rejoiced, but Ravan's wife and his brother Vibhishan were very sad because Ravan was no more. They knew Ravan was doing the wrong thing, but still they felt sad for losing their brother. And Sita Ma was reunited with her Ram. Lakshmanji was happy to see Sita Ma again. And Hanumanji said, he is going to follow Sri Ram anywhere he goes. And you know, just about then, Ram, Sita, Lakshman were coming up on their 14 years of the exile. Remember how they had to live in the forest for 14 years? And they all could return to Ayodhya. And the day Sri Ram Sita and Lakshman return to Ayodhya. With Hanuman is the day we celebrate as Diwali. 
So I hope you enjoyed this Ramayan series. And don't worry, I'll be back soon with another series. I promise. Until then, Namaskar.